This is the solution to written homework 40. Okay, so for part A, we have two formulas here. We have, we have R of V, and we also have V of T. So that means that uh, because R is a function of V and V is a function of T, that means we can interpret R as a function of T uh, in the following way. We can say that R composed with V evaluate at T, well, that is, by definition, R of V of T. So now what does R do with V? It computes cube root of 3 V of T now, divide by 4 pi. <coughs> so that would be cube root 3, and then V of T is 10 plus 20 T, and then divide by 4 pi. And then we can simplify just a little bit anyway by getting, what, 30 plus 60 t? So 30 plus 60 t over 4 pi. And then maybe I'll cancel out a common 2. That would be 15 plus 30 t over 2 pi. So that's the answer to part A. <coughs> so find the exact time when the radius is 10 centimeters. Okay, so B. The request is to find t when <coughs> r of t is, that is to say, r circ v of t is 10. Okay, so that means that take ye ans your answer in part a and set it equal to 10 and solve. Okay, so then 10 is equal to cube root 15 plus 30t over 2 pi. So we want to get rid of the cube root, so we'll cube both sides. Well, 10 cubed is 15 plus 30t. 2 pi. Now 10 cubed is a thousand. <coughs> so that is 1,000 is 15 plus 30 t over 2 pi. Uh, so 2,000 pi. is 15 plus 30 t, so 2,000 pi minus 15 is 30 t, so 2,000 pi minus 15 divided by 30 is t, and that's the answer.